Yes, welcome to the channel. My name's Rob, and in today's video, we're going to see how old people are treated in other countries compared to how old people are treated in good old Poland. If you enjoyed this video, please do make sure you like and subscribe. It will mean the world to me. There's a lot of scary things when you live in a foreign country, I gotta tell you, like um, old people. Yeah. I'm terrified of old people in Poland. He is not wrong. Now, I'm sure old babchas in Poland are lovely. However, the typical image is proper scary. They look like we, I've seen the memes of basically they are the CCTV in Poland. They are like always watching you. They have their like, what do you call it? Like their tea towel -y type things on their head. Um, I don't know what they're called. I'm so sorry. That is not meant to offend anyone. Um, and they're literally looking out of their windows like this. They are proper scary. Whereas old people over here, you sort of more, and this is not trying to be disrespectful at all. I, I am not meaning it that way. I'm saying this in a jokey way. Um, but older people over here are less respected, I feel. And and don't get me wrong, respect um, should be earned. But I don't necessarily think the respect is shown to old people over here. But in Poland, you do not mess with a babcha. Mostly because they're everywhere. <laughs> I don't know if you guys have noticed, but in most Polish cities, towns, and villages, the old people are just walking around <laughs> among you. <laughs> and no one here has a problem with it because they're all used to it. But like, I'm from the States, and when you reach out like 65, 66, we send you away <laughs> to like Florida. Or Arizona, or we like put you in a home with other people your age to play with. And the food is really soft, and there's bingo and shuffleboard. And, and yeah, you just go with the man in white, and he's gonna show you to start the car, start the car. And, like, no, no. and we'll call, we'll visit on the holidays, and we'll. But I've kind of noticed that that shit doesn't fly out here because like Polish old people. Polish old people are hardcore. They're like, I think, I think in it's the same in the UK where you know old people, if there's any sign of deterioration, they go to a home. And I and I don't think I think culturally, maybe in Poland, family is family. Family links are a lot stronger than they are in, for example, the UK or. He says in the United States because we're almost happy to ship off our elderly relatives to care homes, um, and I don't think that's necessarily the case in places like Poland, where you know family look after family, and um, but it does seem like el elderly people in Poland they are hardy. They've been through worse, you know. They'll be fine. <laughs> I survived World War II and communism. Fuck you, I'm gonna go buy a loaf of bread. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Stop it. Always watching. <laughs> Terrifying. They're hardcore, man. Old people are bullies. True. I'm convinced, yeah, they make me feel like I'm a pussy. I don't call it being a pussy, I call it self-preservation. Because when I'm standing, you know, when I'm standing at the crosswalk, you know, waiting for the light to turn green, waiting for like the little guy to walk, I tend to leave about, you know, half a meter between me and the edge of the curb, because I don't want to get hit by a fucking car. <laughs> but if I'm standing there, nine times out of ten, there's usually some little old lady that walks up and sees that spot, and she thinks I'm saving it for her. She's like, <laughs> fucking pussy. <laughs> Now I'm like, Jesus, all right, and I can't go around her because at this point there's a lady with a buggy on this side, another lady with a buggy on this side, I'm trying to figure out what to do. Can't push her over. Because then her friends will come beat me up. <laughs> I've seen they're in a game. They all flash the game signs. It's not just arthritis. <laughs> Terrifying. <laughs> or like the, the most scariest moment I've had being in Poland in six years is about two o'clock in the afternoon. And being the only person under the age of 95 on the tram, you get on, all of the old people just kind of look at you. I wasn't even planning on sitting down. It's fine. It's fine. No problem at all.
I think that's the same. Does Poland, do Poland give um, like free public transport to APs? Because obviously in the UK, pensioners get a bus pass. They get to ride the bus. So if you're on a bus at a certain time, you're probably going to be surrounded by pensioners, basically. Um, but, it's, but it's so true. It does seem like people from countries like from Poland and like Poland, these the older generation are hardy, hardy people, aren't they? They've had worse. They've had worse times. You know, they don't need to be shipped off to some retirement home, do they? They're fine. They can cope themselves. Um, but as I said, it does seem like family is a bigger thing um, in, in Poland, and not just Poland, but um, Central slash Eastern Europe. Uh, I know how people get about Eastern Europe, but you know what I mean. And I don't think that's the case over here. Uh, you know, over here in the UK and in the United States, like I said, we're happy to ship older people that so show any sign of deterioration to care homes. That's just the way it is. Um, we don't often have them in our own home look after them. Um, I probably should say that if my mum got ill, I'd look after her, but I haven't got space. That's all I'm going to say. I have not got space in my house. Um, it's very true. He's very, very true. It was quite funny there. Thank you so much for watching. A nice little short one to entertain you on this day. Thank you so much. Papa.